We believe artists should stay independent, keep complete control of their uh, careers, and not be tied down by unfair deals and shady industry contracts. DJ Rockstar here from International Rock Beats. Today's video is about Ditto. Ditto is my distributor who I distribute my music to over 150 stores all around the world. I'll leave a link down in the description of this video so you can do the same. Hope you enjoy the video. Careers and not be tied down by unfair deals and shady industry contracts. Amen to that. Uh, some of the people well, hell, some of the people nowadays done been through that, you know what I mean? So it's <laughs> the, art, the uh, industry still practice how they practice, I guess. But that gives you a little bit more freedom, uh, gives you a lot more freedom and a lot more control over your uh, content that you're creating, you know, your music and everything. So anyway, uh, moving on, it says SS Insights. OK. So basically what that is, if you look up here where it says my dashboard, it says track your music performance across platforms and countries around the world. Uh, delve into streaming insights, download numbers and listeners uh, demographic data from your personal ditto dashboard to help you plan the best next step for your career. So basically you look over here and you see all the little charts and graphs and everything. And it just like you can go, uh, if I'm not mistaken, like uh, you can look at the last seven days uh of your songs or how see how your music's performing uh you can look at 28 or either 30 days uh, i think spotify is 28 or about 28 days and it'll make you do 30 you know and you can look back lifetime or whatever you know but um my point is it's like you can see how it actually shows you like how your music is moving up and how many numbers of streams you got per day you know or per week or whatever and then it shows you uh, if you go down, you know, like right now, I'm not um, I don't, my music's not just like super hot. So, you know, my my music be kind of like up, down, you know, and everything. That's why we go so hard. But I mean, that's part of the fun is 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 trying to build the audience, um, you know, um, from scratch. Because, I mean, if you think about it, if you starting fresh, you have no audience. You know, you got friends and family. And yeah, okay. That first record or two, the friends and family is gonna show up and everything, and you can't get mad at them when they don't because really they, you know, like like my friends and family, they know me as just Charles. You know, they don't. I'm not saying they don't care about DJ Rockstar, but it's like that's some secondary stuff. They hope my music do do well. You know that, right? But you got to look at it like that because if not. You you know you you'll feel disappointed and everything, um, but anyway, um, so yeah, just so you want to basically what I'm trying to say to wrap all that up is basically you want to really use your social media, uh, you want to have a marketing plan. I mean, this is if you have a marketing budget, it's good to um you know do some advertisement and everything. You know you get a chance to do all that yourself, or you got companies out here you could pay for uh you know, to do that for you and everything, you know, which I'll probably do a video on some of that, but you could YouTube all that stuff. Anyway, moving along, cause I don't want to make it too, too long. Um, these are some of the big artists that, uh, that, that distribute their music through Ditto, uh, either started there. And of course they may have record deals now, but, uh, you guys know all these people, Ed Sheeran, uh, Clario, Sam Smith, Chance the Rapper, Francis and the Lights. Okay, and you can look at the numbers of um, streams when it got like 100, what is that, is that 10 billion? 10 billion, uh, 70 million, 4 billion, uh, 
28 million. I think that is 200 million. This is something that's uh, revolutionary uh, with distributing your music nowadays. Okay, so you get smart links. Okay, um, basically what this is, uh, Diddle Smart Link. Just say you got a song come out, and the song is called uh, Sounds of Yesterday or whatever, right? And um, so that song comes out, you release it on a Friday. They say everybody may not listen to Spotify, right? Some people may like to listen to Tidal. Some people may like to listen to music on YouTube. Well, uh, or, or, you know, um, Apple, whatever, Amazon. So this is a link, a, like a link tree. It basically has your Spotify, your, um, uh, all of the, the different uh, music platforms, the major platforms, um, to where you got your, your um, listeners and followers covered. You share it like on uh, Instagram, Facebook, or Twitter, and people could just hit that link. When they hit it, it opened up, and it looks it looks like what what it looks like on the phone here. You know, uh, artwork will be up here, so forth, and you got the different uh, words that you can listen on. So you just choose whatever. That's pretty neat, you know. Um, some more distributors that do that as well, but um, I really like that feature. But anyway, royalty share, right? So just say. You reach out and say, hey, DJ Rockstar, I want you to uh, hop on this song with me or I want you to produce this track for me, whatever it may be, you know, or whoever it may be, right? Um, you know, you could do your, your, your royalty share, you know, uh, different percents and everything through Ditto, and that's pretty good. That's that's actually a, that's a big, big plus right there. So a uh, great way to gain uh, extra fans too, uh, or not extra, but... um tap into different fan markets or, or, or followers or whatever and orders and stuff because you know like just say the people who support me may have never heard of you or the people who support you may have never heard of me you get it so yeah that's a good way to grow all right so yeah and um see some quotes so yeah they distribute your music all over the world okay and they have offices all over the world uh and everything it's a pretty big operation Pricing. Let's go here. All right, let's look at pricing. So it cost me nineteen dollars a year. I could put out a thousand records, literally, um, in that year. In that twelve months, I could I could release a thousand singles, albums, uh, maxi. Um, what is it? Maxi singles. I almost forgot what you call them. But I could, you know, you you could put out as much. You could do a million of them. They may say something if you do a million. They may say something if you do a thousand. I mean, that's a lot of records, right? But uh, I don't think they would. I mean, because it's like unlimited, see? Release unlimited music for one artist, $19 a year. If you just got only like accidental streams, like, you know, like did no marketing, no, no, no kind of way marketing your music and stuff, trying to grow a fan base or, a, you know, follower base or whatever. I don't like to use the word fan, so that's why you. Uh, catch it like that i mean that'll pay for that by itself you know just pay it every year 19 bucks that's like i wish back in the 90s they'd have had that if they'd have had that like if, if it would have been like this back then man but you know the thing is you got to stay on top of your game okay i know like other distributors like um I think like CD Baby, it's a few of them. They charge you like okay, you pay like that at one fee up front, and then they charge you for every release you put out. And then like if, you know, if you look up and you put out so many records, after you get like I don't know like you know ten records, or just say if after, if you got four records out there, that's gonna cost you a pretty nice chunk every year to keep them in the markets. You see. But with this nineteen dollars a year, that's affordable. You know, that's how I looked at it and everything. All right. So, like I said, I'm not gonna make it too long, but you know, I just want to point out like little stuff like that because, um, you know, artists we don't be having a bunch of money when we we be trying to get started and stuff. You know, you know, the the term uh, what is it, starving artists? Uh, that's you know, that's kind of real. You know what I mean? So, um, I figured you guys could appreciate that. You know, nineteen bucks a year, folks. Okay, plus right now they're doing a 30-day free trial. 
I don't know how that works. Maybe you don't pay the 19th after the first 30 days or whatever you do your first release or something, but you know, like I said, okay. So what's included? Okay. I'm gonna kind of go fast here on the artist. All right. And you can read it as well, but release unlimited music everywhere. That's worldwide. Keep 100% of the royalties. Okay. View listener data and demographics. That's the charts I was telling you about. Access to major label. I'm sorry. Access major label promo tools. Okay. So I did a promotion with them uh, for my song, Anybody Home. Uh, I just wanted to try it and see how it worked and everything. They did a really good job. I got more Instagram. Uh, my Instagram numbers went up, you know, followers. Uh, I got a few more streams and everything. And I got placed on a playlist uh, by Ditto. I uh, got covered by two two uh, magazines. And um, that's some more stuff. Plus, like, okay, so what was priceless to me and everything is um, I... I got um, like a database or I got access to a database of um, uh, bloggers, magazines, um, people to, you know, like if you want to just say you got a new release coming up and you, you want a, a promotion, you know, you want a, a publicity and everything. Well, you know, you could if you got the the, the what I'm trying to say, if you got the. Um, the people's information, you get in touch with them. If not, you got to pay somebody to get in touch with them. You understand what I'm saying? Uh, so, like, for example, like XXL Magazine, right? I got the contact info, you know, and the person, the actual person's email and their name. And uh, I think maybe phone number. I'm not sure about phone number, but I got the stuff and actual uh, to actually get in touch with them and everything. And I didn't. I didn't get it to recently, so I hadn't used it yet, any of it. But um, I plan on using some this summer and everything, try to get some uh, placements and stuff. I think it may be some playlists, playlist people in there as well. But that, I, I mean, it's like, I think maybe like, maybe like 500 different names in, uh, or 500 different um, uh, PR contacts in there. You know, it may be more like 700, but to me, that was priceless because you got to look at it for somebody who's coming into the music business that has like no active contacts, you know, not, I mean, you know, it, the people I knew are, you know, not popping no more, you know? So it's just, you know, I, I thought that was a, uh, that was a plus, you know, but I'm not going to disclose how much I paid for it. You can find out how much it's it's on the website. You can find out how much the promotion would cost and everything. Because the reason why I don't want to get a, the number out because prices may change, you know. But um, anyway, so yeah, what was we at? Uh, get music. Um, you start up here. Automatic split royalty payments. Join a global music network. Get music insights and analytic reports. Submit for playlists. Protect your music copyrights. Uh, release music for multiple artists. That's okay. So now, now we're getting over into the other plans. I think you could do like two, two uh, art, artists on professional, and up to five, I think, on label or at that price they show. But like, if you pay more, you could probably go up to like ten or, or even more. You know, it's just the price is gonna call, it's gonna go up. All right. And uh, compilation releases. So you can do compilation projects over here. Over here, you can't. So that's, you know, if that's something you, you're into, you want to be at least over here. Uh, you know, it's up to you. OK, now. Let's see. Now, since I've started and I, I publish my music in a different way and everything, but um. Ditto now is offering publishing, okay? So, you might be missing out on royalties you didn't know existed. Let's claim what you're owed. Okay, start earning publishing royalties now for just $49. Okay, so, 
that's between you and them if, the, if that's what you want to do uh it may may be the thing for you you know you're publishing and everything it's a way to publish your music but to become a publisher and and you know it's just more work what the more stuff you do it's more work okay and i i always have to use i can't speak for nobody else so i have to use my experiences the best i could tell you is this with me everything from the hi-hat that says to the kick drum that said don't to the artwork if it's a typo in it i misspelled it you understand what i'm saying to the videos that's produced you know uh out of his lyric videos i do 100 percent of my work time and i ain't gonna lie i be tired as hell but that's how you have to do it when you don't have a you know the budget to always you know what i'm saying i mean so i had to learn other stuff you know everything and i still have people calling me like friends that's in it that's doing the same thing and they be like man how you know what you use for that how you do it? you know i mean if you, if you all you got to do is go back and look at my old videos like six videos ago i'm just now starting to use the obs where you can see my face and then you'll hear me talk about it in some videos um yeah i'm gonna get the screen recorder uh, i'm gonna find the right screen recorder or whatever and it's just like i you i mean do you realize what i had to go through at my age to learn, you know, I mean, cause that's, this is all like everything that's going on now. We, yo, when we released a record back in the day, we hopped in the van, we hopped in the car. We had our arms full of records. We had crates full of records. We went to the clubs, you know, we drive down to Florida. We drive, you know, you know, I'm trying to say that everything is different, man. It's easier, but it's this technical stuff. So for you, you, you people, I guess I'm gonna say it like this for you, younger people or, or internet savvy people it should be a breeze for you because i've never been that kind of person you know that that internet savvy and if i could learn it i know you guys can too you know and everything so but anyway a lot of the tools are um are free that you would do it with you know and um so that would save you some money it's just all about the learning curves you know so um but going back to the royalties, you can um, you could become a uh, I'm sorry the publishing you could become a publisher yourself and do your own royalties, or you can um, it's it's other you know other publishers and stuff out there that you can sign up with, or you can just roll with Ditto's publishing. Uh, that's probably what they would like. I mean, they're not paying me for this video, everything, <laughs> but I'm just saying they probably would like it if I see it then, huh? But um, yeah, I mean, it's 49 bucks. I haven't read into it, but like I said, I would read all contracts, um, you know, and um, I would do everything, you know, myself. Uh, I'm sorry, I would read the contracts and make sure that's what you want to do, everything. If not, uh, do your own publishing, you know, everything. Because it's a lot of money that artists, especially like independent artists uh, leave on the table. You know, I could make some more videos about that stuff. And uh, if, if you're not, you know, taking care of your business, you won't, you won't get it. So anyway, earn more from your music. Okay. Register unlimited music worldwide. So register your music for publishing royalties across the globe while you keep full ownership and copyright. Okay. Sounds good fair and direct payment we only take a 10 percent commission on publishing royalties okay they don't take 10 percent on the on the streaming royalties only on the publishing okay we collect and you keep all the rest won't find a better deal anywhere else in the industry okay new royalties and sync opportunities so now when you get into the sync that's a whole different kind of money right there I haven't got any sync placements um, as of yet, but that sync money be nice. Y'all, um, yeah. So that's like video games and um, TV shows, you know, uh, films, movies and stuff. Yeah, I think about it like, how many times people watch that, you know? And like how many times are 
uh, you know, they streaming it or whatever it is. If your sounds is in that, just say you go on a TV show. Okay. It could be like any TV show and that thing is in, um, reruns are happening. I said thing run for like 10 years. And you got, you, you get money on the front end of that and you get money on the back end of that. So, you know, that's crazy. But like I said, that's another video. Okay. If you write and release your own music, but don't claim publishing royalties, you're missing out. Okay. If you write and release your own music, but don't claim publishing royalties, you're missing out. Okay. That says a lot right there. So, yeah. Okay. Um, the performer get paid a set of royalties. The writer get paid a set of royalties as well. Okay. So you got to know all that. It breaks down how it works. Okay. But this is not a video about royalties. All right. But uh, like I said, all this is on the website. I'll let you guys, uh, you know, go in and check it out. This is where you choose to distribute um, what, you know, your song. This is where you go to build your song out. It's real simple. It's easy. Uh, standard release and uh, EDM releases are over here. So, uh, this, this is okay. Like, so I distribute my music through both ways, but like when, when you, when I'm doing something, that's a, when I'm doing one of my dance songs, it's going to be done through Beatport. Okay. So this is where I would go for that. And like my standard releases, that's not, you know, because I, I do several different genres of music and everything, you know, so it may be, um, just say like, um, like when I did top of the moot, I went standard release. Okay. Um, Fall down. Uh, I didn't do that beat port. I think. Um, I did, I got like three different beat port releases. When I first started, I wasn't doing it. Fall down should have been on beat port, but it wasn't. And, and you know, it's we could talk about beat port later on and stuff. But um, you see, DJ Rockstar, uh, nineteen releases. So come in. Let's see, complete. Okay. All those sent to the store. Okay. My latest release is Education. Came out 2022. Uh, this is uh, March, at the end of March, and I only got like one release out this year. So I'm, I'm planning on having a big summer, though, you know, spring and summer. I got a lot of stuff coming. A lot of party music. But yeah, that's, um, and this was a, this is an album. I know, you know, you're not here to hear about my music, but so this album is put together and I'm going to do a part two to it. It's called the time machine. It's like music that we recorded in 2000 in the year 2000. So it's like, yeah, this music is like 22 years old. And it was, I, I was like, it, this was on this one. I think a lot of it never had been released, but I mean, none of it was released majorly. It's something we was doing out the trunk of our car at the time, you know, that type of release. But um, this thing is um, it's crazy. It's crazy when if if you guys get a chance to check it out, it's hardcore. It's not you know, it's nothing. If you like the other kind of music, it's we do some cussing on that. And I'm gonna let you know right now. It's I was man, I was I was young. We was young. All of us was. We kind of rough, you know. But, you know, it ain't mean no harm. We was having fun. But anyway, um, that's the time machine. And that's from back in the old thug camp days. Uh, what we used to call ourselves. But um, all this right here is new music. Everything, everything else is new. If you guys get a chance, you can check it out and stuff. The promotion, analytics, royalties. We're not going there. All right. <laughs> Videos. All right. Let's see. On the videos, um, I don't have any up. Let's see, uh, music. Oh yeah, we already here. Videos. So basically, this would be your dashboard. This is how you do your uh, Vivo. Okay, so 
you already got, you know, your $19 paid for the year, right? All right, you already distributed music and you want to put out an, um, a music video. Okay, so Vivo Channel set up. You know, it's not just like, you know what I'm saying? It's like you got they got to set it up. And uh, I don't know what all comes with that, but like I said, I know you actually make, you make good money from your, your Vivo videos, okay? That costs $99 to set it up. That's a one-time fee, okay? A new Vivo channel. And every time Vivo video upload, every time, from my understanding, that you release a music video, you're going to pay 29 bucks. I don't think that's a bad deal. Pay this one time. So seven years down the road, you're still putting music videos out. All that costs you is twenty nine dollars for a music video that you're making good money on. Okay, so get your latest music video online, upload your video to the biggest platform, forms. I'm sorry, and start earning royalties. Okay, so that's like we could put it on YouTube for all our friends to watch and hope we get monetized. But if you're not monetized, man, go this way. That's what I'm gonna do. My channel's not monetized yet on YouTube. You know, I'm still trying to build, trying to get, um, we're right at 100 subscribers now. So, um, you know, we, we got to have like, what is it? 1,000 subscribers, 4,000 watch hours in like the last 12 months. Yeah, so, you know, we make it hard out here for, for independent artists. But, you know, Hard but fair. All right, so we're not going to royalties. All right. <laughs> we'll go to uh, analytics. I'll let you guys look at that. Uh, all right. Yeah. So in the last week, 476 total streams. Okay. And you see, my release date was Friday. Okay, I got a hundred streams on Spotify. That Friday. That's when education came out. The last song I had come out. Okay, and it started tanking down. Well, for uh ninety six plays, seventy nine, you see what you see how it goes. So, uh Monday, we had like twenty five people listening to it. Back up, sixty eight. And that's like anything. It goes up and then it kind of levels off. But I did uh, very little promotion on it, but I did promote some. And Apple Music, I had one person listen to it uh, Saturday. Okay. So let's look at, um, let's see something. Let's go. All right, we're doing seven days, right? So let's go. Let's go 30 days. Okay. And so you can see how the spike came in right here. It was just kind of moving along, moving along, moving along, moving along. I start promoting and building up anticipation. The song came out March 18th. So, you know, like, let's go back here. 15 plays February 23rd. I haven't been doing much promotion. So that's, that's how it goes. Okay. Some people with less plays than that. But, uh, boom. Stop. Down 33. Jumps up to 100. Now. And, like, the way I did it, I run Facebook ads. I don't have a big budget, so I don't put a lot of money into it, you know, but I run Facebook ads. I run Instagram ads. Um, to the best of my ability, you know, it's something that I'm learning, you know, how to do right now. You know, so, um, yeah. You know, run your ads and uh, promote. And it'll help you out. All right. Let's see. going to be one. all right but yeah that is 
you know. Like I said, folks, if you're interested in it, in the ditto, look down in the description of this video. And it's probably going to be in some more videos, too, because I put that affiliate link in there on a lot of different videos. But just look down in the description and you'll see it and just hit it. And it'll bring you right here so you can sign up. Um, and like I said, right now, they're doing a 30 day free. Um, 30 day free trial. I don't know exactly how that works, but I'm thinking it's going to work to where, you know, you, you pay the, the 19 bucks or whatever, uh, plan you sign up for at the end of the 30 days, you may have to put a card on file or something, but I think that's how it's probably going to go. Yeah. Let me know what you guys think and everything. And, um, Hope you hope I shed some light on it. I tried to not make it too long, but uh, that's right at 40 minutes. So by the time I edit it down, you know, we'll be shorter than that. Also, I'm going uh, to go ahead and let you guys know we're going to be doing a. Um, I'm starting to talk about it right now. I, I haven't launched it yet, but we got a, a lot of great things coming up. First off, let me just say this. Let me back up. All right. For it. You guys, like that's the producers, the independent artists, uh, up and coming artists, meaning that you hadn't came out yet, you know, you hadn't signed up with Ditto yet or whatever. My business partner, by the name of the King of Cali, okay, we have a, um, a independent artist and producer friendly radio station that we're running on the internet called Beat Nation media or beat nation radio is the name of the station but um we're gonna do it's called beat nation media okay and um if that's something that you guys are interested in make sure you holler at us and uh um, get with us and um you know let's see about you know getting your music once it's released on the radio because you know that too pays royalties dang um you know, you can sign up with um, BMI as an artist. That's that's free. It don't cost you anything. It's for life, you know. So that's how you would get that money. Um, I've been a member of ASCAP for a long time, everything. But it takes a little bit for that money to accumulate from radio plays. But it comes in. So, yeah, if you're an independent artist, um, and you have music that's published through a company, you know, you need to be like a company like Ditto or, you know, it's published. So you have all your um, metadata and stuff together. Um, get with us and, you know, check us out. I'll leave that link, link down there so you guys can go on and check out the radio station. I also, um, you can get with us over at, um, Facebook at Beat Nation Media. Okay. Uh, we have a group. It's a private group um, for people like us, you know. Uh, Beat Nation Media. And um, King of Cali, he runs a. Um, <laughs> he runs a. Um, underground hip hop and rap show on beat nation media. It's called spoken wars. Okay. Wars spelt with a Z W A R Z spoken wars. All right. And they doing some uh, tremendous things over there and everything, but, um, we're accepting all genres of artists. Okay. Uh, everything from um, hip hop to uh, to rock, you know. We're gonna do. Um, I'm gonna be doing some some new playlists on the radio station and everything. And I need more artists, so uh, we're actually looking for uh, artists that will, you know, uh, that puts out you know nice music and everything that want 
radio play. Uh, is, you know, we're not charging for that. Um, that's why we're, you know, friendly to the uh, independent artists and everything. We're not charging for that. Um, and we also have some uh, playlists on Spotify. Um, got some coming on Tidal. Uh, and hope to do some on Apple. So, if that's something that you guys are interested in, um, get with us, like I said. And, um, you know, let's see, you know, we can help each other grow. Also, now, with that being said, I had to, you know, plug all that stuff and everything. Um, it, it'd be more, I talk more about it. I'm probably going to do a video. Me and Callie probably get on here together and that'd be something nice to do do a video and, and really break down everything to you guys, but I want to let the cat out the bag. You know what I'm saying? So with that being said, I want to say that, um, uh, I'm going to be doing a Patreon, um, channel as well. I got it. See me set up, you know, and everything. And, um, you know, we're going to do some, some exciting things up in there and, and everything as well. So you guys just, you know, you want to look out for it if that's something that you think you may be interested in. Um, Patreon channel is coming. Uh, you'll be able to find the link on Instagram, Facebook, uh, YouTube, everywhere. I'll be talking about it once. Thing. Well, I'll be, you know, kind of like building up to a launch date, you know, and everything. Um, so, yeah, we're trying to grow. Trying to grow, y'all. All right. But that's it. Kind of tired. <laughs> Appreciate you guys uh, hanging in there with me through this this um, this video and everything, and uh, hopefully you got some good stuff out of it. And everything um, you have to excuse all the extra noises and stuff around here. My phone going off and all that, but um, I just wanted to get on here and talk to y'all, you know, and just um, let y'all know some of the things that was going on. Uh, if you're like I said, artists, producers. Hopefully you got something valuable out of this. Hopefully Ditto was making sense to you. If not, if you don't go with Ditto, I mean, you got other options and, and everything as well, but it's just, this is the way I did my thing. And I thought it'd be good to make a video about it and stuff, especially since I got the uh, affiliate link, you know, everything. And just kind of show some people how inexpensive it can be to get started with this stuff. Because, you know, over the last two years, last two years i came out with uh tell me in uh eight june june of 2020 yeah june of 2020 i met a lot of artists a lot of artists on the you know internet um <laughs> that was want me to do something with their music but they only had the music on SoundCloud and they had put it there themselves or either on YouTube and they had put it, and it's like, I, well, I tell you what, this is what I'll do just so I don't make this video too long. I'll make another video about what every, well, not every store, but what the stores pay. We'll make a video about that. And, uh, and I have it nice and detailed. And everything and it just be I put it up on the screen you guys can see it and uh you know and you we get we'll get the understanding then because you know it, it, money ain't everything but it, it'd be kind of nice to be comp, you know compensated for all the hard work and hours that you guys you know that we all put in to whatever we do you know so with that being said I'm gonna say peace and uh hope I ain't forgetting that. And if I did, y'all hit me on the comment about it. <laughs> All right, appreciate y'all watching. Peace. Uh, oh, also, real quick. I'm gonna do another beat video. Um it probably sometime after this video come out in the next day or two, it'll be followed up by another beat video and everything. All right, so peace.